Okay, everybody. Happy Global Magnet Fishing Cleaning Day. I gotta handle some stuff, and uh, y'all are on my chest harness. Uh, real quick before I head out there, and then I'm gonna head out there, and then uh, we'll get to magnet fishing. Hopefully some people see my meet and greet thing and uh, come out and say hi, magnet fish with me. But, uh, yeah, shaved my head. I got hair conditioning now. <laughs> so, uh, we'll see you all at the spot. Okay, y'all, we got some bubbles right there. They've been bubbling up as soon as I got here. We're going to see if that's anything. Yeah, that might be a fish, though. Truth be told. But, uh... Let's see if there's anything here. And I'm going to try real quick to see if I can grab that out of the water. Okay, we got a guy here who just lost his glasses. We're going to see if we can get them. It's a 50-50 shot. Uh, I pulled sunglasses, all kinds of stuff out of here. So. Oh, yeah, they're right here. As long as you generally know. The only problem would be is if they've gone under this concrete lip. Ooh. That would be about it. Uh, I was just leaned over and they was in my shirt pocket. Okay. Are they glasses or sunglasses? Glasses, metal ones. Okay, they should. They might stick to the magnet. Tell you the truth, mm -hmm. if they're not uh, aluminum or stainless or something like they that. They fell down right there. I really didn't want to jump in there with all them bubbles. You, you gets too deep. It is. It, is it like ten foot maybe. I know when it was below this lip, it was still like a good solid foot over my head. But at the same time, there's so much stuff down there. It's not. It ain't worth it. Yeah. There's somebody who lost their transition Nike prescription sunglasses, and they didn't dive in after those. Yeah, right. But this spot, I've I've cleaned a lot out, and uh, what have you found in here that's cool? That's like any guns or anything? Twelve gauge shotgun right there. <laughs> a uh, okay. We haven't found that guy's glasses yet, but we did pull up this stuff. Some kind of bracket there and this big old thing and some fishing string we're gonna keep throwing out here and if I find anything I'll show y'all not the glasses we're looking for but another pair of Ray-Bans crazy he's been down there a minute we'll look these up after a while. Alright. And we did pull up that uh, bit of bubble wrap. What we got down here. Uh, okay. Cool. Ray-Bans. First cool find. We've been getting trash out of the water. Alright. Pull this up. No baggy. Pulled up a zip tie in another part. So we'll set that there. We pulled up these fishing weights. And a hook Throw that grass back in there Hang on the magnet Take that that little hook says that one right there we'll clean off our magnet I don't know if we'll find these glasses but we are going to try our best to find them for that guy especially it being global magnet cleanup alrighty Looks like we got a piece of clothing for UT. Uh, is this a graduation thing? <laughs> Gown? That one's crazy. We'll find. Hey, we got a catfish bell on our magnet. And a fairly clean one. Heck yeah. We just pulled this up another fishing pole tip. Yeah. It's down there. Maybe. That may have broke off. 
And I'm, okay. I don't know if there's anything other than trash on the end of this. That was what was on the end of that. We got a little bit of plastic on our magnet. We're gonna keep on keeping on till we can't move our arms no more today or uh, it's that other stuff. That's just crazy though. Graduation gown. That's everything we've got so far. Got to get that stuff over there and put it over here with this stuff. Try and keep it all together. <laughs> we hooked us a Mountain Dew can. Mountain Dew can. Well, I'm starting to wonder if someone uh, is running around here naked. <laughs> Nothing in the pockets, it seems. Okay. I'm going to take a short little intermission. And, uh, get me a drink and relax a second. Oh my god, y'all, we pulled up a Power Ranger. The Red Ranger. Ah, we pulled him up. That's amazing. Well, no idea if anyone knows what era that's from. Let me know. We've just found little bits of stuff. I uh, found one of these hair thingies. And uh, steel wire. That's from earlier. We're still at it. And we're still going. All right, y'all. Okay, we might have something on here. Oh, yep, big old ball of fishing string. Okay, we're on something, and I think we got it finally to come up out of the mud. We did. What is this, y'all? <sighs> Gently pulling it up. It's huge, whatever it is, and it's heavy. What is this? rocks back in. Somebody's makeshift anchor maybe. Very cool. Or evidence to keep their stuff in a bag maybe. Because it is wrapped in a bag. Look at that y'all. I think we caught us a radio. Let's go take a look. Okay. I think that's what that definitely is. Ooh. Craig Radio. Let's see, we want FM, don't we? <laughs> Very cool. We're going to throw this in our bouquet. All right, y'all. There we go. All cleaned up, y'all. Cool. All right. Let's see if we find anything else. Um, we had a guy come and take our trash. Nice guy. Uh, may have been part of maintenance. By the way, I found this on my way down to those two docks. Everything we found at the two docks went in the trash. Um, this works still. I guess this fell out of somebody's pocket. There's still fuel in it. Yeah, I can hear it. Bic, give me a sponsor. I find your lighters and prove they work after being in the water for God knows how long. Alrighty, y'all. We found one, y'all. We found a fishing pole, and it was an ugly stick. And I think I can get it. I think I might still be on it. Maybe, possibly. We're going to get that one if it's the last thing I do. Because that's right there. Had it come up. Is that it? 
Oh no, you will come up. You are my fishing pole of the day. There it is. Come on, nice and easy. Oh, you gonna be a pain to get now? Oh, I'm so mad, so mad. We gotta get this thing, y'all. I'm gonna get it. Pretty sure it said ugly stick. I think we're on. Definitely got something. Yeah, it did say ugly stack. Oh, yeah. Look at that, y'all. We got us an ugly stack GX2 open bail this time. It's got all its eyelets. It does. Let me clean it up, and we'll see if we're, see if it spins. All righty, y'all. I wanted to show you one of our lures. We'll be using when we go fishing. And we will be using this fishing pole, too. This one works perfectly fine. And we're going to use this little lure right here just for fun. And this is practically brand new. And I am a tickled pink. And I'm just can't believe this thing works as good. I find good ones here all the dang time, and I knew I was hooking into something. So. 49th fishing pole found and it's a ugly stick oh my favorite kind we'll clean it up when we get home all righty we're raining here and it's thundering so I'm up underneath this thing chilling out we did find this ugly stick it is in perfect working order ugly stick GX2 and I gotta do a minimal clean out of mud and that is it y'all tickled pink we pulled this up today so this will go with us with our Zebco 33's when we go do our magnet fishing fishing rod video So, this ain't the end of the video. I'm here for another four hours waiting on a ride. So as soon as it stops raining, if it stops raining, we'll get back out there magnet fishing. I don't feel like fishing in the rain today. But I am enjoying this breeze. And we are gonna go get that box though right there before it blows away. So, we'll be back. And we also found a Ohio State Smith, I can't see what that says, jersey and a hoodie. And it has stopped raining, so we're going to get back to it. I don't know how much more time I've got between rain, so we're going to keep trying to magnet fish this spot, see what else we pull up. So coming uh, this way. That's how I pulled up that pole. And we found this weird thing, some kind of foam, which I'm trying to let drain out, but it's got to drain again. Alright y'all, we'll see if we find something. Look at that, we just put up a pair of channel locks y'all. Train again. But we found a tool. Very cool. And it's raining again. I don't know how long this one is going to last. Barely made it in here before it started pouring. But uh, it quits raining. We'll go back out. We did find those channel locks. So that's, that's cool. So 
Little throw back out there if it clears up. All right, y'all. We'll see you in a second. All right, y'all. We pulled up this uh, shirt. About the only thing. Interesting we pulled up in the last hour and a half. So, I'm headed home. Okay, everybody. I'm sunburnt as all get out. <laughs> I have to wear a hat every time I go magnet fishing now. So time to find my magnet fishing hat. Um, as you can see right there, we got our fishing pole we found. That nice ugly stick G2. And in honor of Global Magnet Fishing Day cleanup, I am going to attempt to clean up. Let me get out of that way. The Bart shirt. And make that my official magnet fishing shirt. I've already hit it with the hose. And it's already gotten like 20 times shader white. <laughs> um, it's cool. That's the only reason why, you know. <laughs> but uh, I hope everybody's doing well wherever you are. Morning, noon, night, wherever you are. And if you're not doing well, I hope you get to doing well real soon. Um, phew. Been a crazy day. Yeah, you see how red I am. But uh, I had fun today. And I hope you did too. We did find some cool stuff with our magnet and our claw. And we got that area even more clean than we already had it. Which is a good thing. And I hope everybody had some great finds today. And I hope everybody's doing well. And nobody had any troubles today. Rain ain't troubles to me. It was nice and cool, to be honest. So, uh, we will catch you all in the next one. I gotta sit and think where I want to go for the next one. And, uh, I don't know. Um, we might hit some old spots in Elk Ridge. Maybe. Not sure. Or Oliver Springs. It, it depends. Um, I haven't been by Bull Run in a minute. Who knows? But uh, we will catch everybody later. And thank y'all for everything. We will see you all in the next one. And boy. <laughs>